Honestly, these past few days have been crazy. What everybody, it's another wonderful Wednesday here in the magical world of Sierra. And I'm sorry, I know I promised Quentin, but he had some trouble and that was some stuff I could not control. I'm really sorry. I know I promise he'll be coming up in the future. I promise, I promise. The f also, for all my fibers that went to tonight's concert, please tweet me on what happened with what happened with that and just send me all your pictures and everything that happened with the hashtag I am five concert so just tweet me at adorable cc16 my twitter name will be in the link description below so just let me know how that went I can't wait to see and for those of you going to the concert on Friday let me know what goes on there too so yeah I'm really really excited for that also I want to make one Thing, click. This is a painting. This is a. This is not my best painting, but it's a. You get the gist of it. it says Girl Meets World on it. Watch this show. This show is just really, really good. I love watching it. It's probably like one of my all-time favorite Disney shows right now, and it's just really, really good. It comes on every Friday on Disney Channel at eight o'clock. So make sure you watching this. Make sure you are watching this show because it's just really good. You, hear, you see this Girl Meets World. It's just really, really awesome, and it's just you'll love it. I guarantee you will. Also, if you guys can see this picture, this is a picture of Anna from Frozen. And I actually learned how to draw from another YouTuber by the name of Dramatic Parrot. Her real name is Percy. And you can go check out her channel. I'll put a link above and also a link in the description below. You know, just to... And she does a whole bunch of tutorials and all that good stuff. She can teach you how to draw any Disney character you want. Or any just regular character that you want. So yeah, make sure you go check out the Dramatic Parrot. And like I said, the link will be in the description below. So make sure you watch Girl Meets World. And then check out Dramatic Parrot. So, yeah. Okay, on to the video. So, I bet you guys did not know this, but I'm also a writer. I've written my first play and got it completed, wrote many, many, many poems, and I also write, like to write stories. Basically, I could be a Shakespeare if I wanted to be. The Black Sh So, I figured I'd do a little bit of a spoken word for you guys, because I wrote this poem, and I kind of want to know what you think. Leave comments down below letting me know what you guys think of the poem, and should I do more of this? I don't know. I don't know what you guys would like, so just leave a comment below what you would like me to do because frankly I just don't know. But yeah, so without further ado and enough of me babbling, let's get on to it. This is called My Baby. When I first met you, it wasn't love at first sight, but when you first started talking to me, my heart had took flight. Your smile was sweet and your teeth pretty too. You made me so crazy I was totally into you. Your ch kisses were like milk chocolate kissing on a cloud. You said I was your one and only, and I was so proud. When I was around you, my heart had wings and I could fly, touch every star in the sky. And when I was around you, I asked, will you be mine? You were like my diary, telling my secrets out to you. You made it feel like our love and trust was really true. Like Nikki, you protected my honor and defended my pride. And your love was so sweet, it made me so weak. You talked about your dreams and you loved me so, but I wanted to keep our relationship on the down low. But I was your queen and you were my king. Together we were inseparable, at least that's what it seemed. When I thought about you, it was nothing but butterflies, rainbow, and candy galore. But then I started to wonder, did I want you anymore? But I keep you around because you make me feel good, even though we were from two different hoods. Every day I would try to find a way to describe you in my eyes. It meant you were special. And that's no surprise. And like Kendra, you never killed my vibe. We talked for hours, day in and day out. But the only problem was, I wasn't allowed out. And for a while, I thought everything was great, excellent, and spectacular. Until our love ended in a great disaster. Now I stand here, feeling so despair. Feeling like my heart has been chopped and paired. I cry and scream and throw things across the floor. I take all your stuff and I throw it in a river drawer. You were like the sweet monster that lived under my bed. Now I feel like you mauled me in anger instead. And when you broke it off, it sounded like you didn't even care. Maybe that's why my heart is in darkness and despair. <laughs> but here's the thing. I was young and in love. And you were older, and you had past number ones. I didn't know what to do, so you took control, and you guided me too. You felt about me different, and so did I. But what did you expect? I guess we didn't see eye to eye. And through all the things you took me through, you made me who I am, honey. Like Mariah, you will always be my baby. So yeah, guys, that's it. That is my poem. So make sure you like this video, and share it. And make sure you subscribe to my channel. I put up videos every, every Wednesday. 
But yeah, that is it. I love you all. I love you all with peace and pizza. Bye.